Hi preschool families, it's Miss Delaney and I'm here to do an art project with you. This week's theme is nature and I know you went outside with Miss Corbett and did a scavenger hunt and you read a story with Miss Corbett and I know you read a story that we're going to do our art project on today. It's called It Looked Like Spilt Milk and you read that with Miss Jenny, right? Oh, I hope you remember that story because we're going to need it for this art project. Are you guys ready? All right, well here we go. This project is super simple and it only needs three things. The first thing you'll need is a piece of blue construction paper. Simple, right? We'll also need some white paint. I'm using this little bottle with puffy paint, but you can use any type of paint. And then I'm also using a marker so that I can mark what I see in the sky with my clouds. So you remember in our story that the book is blue and that's the sky, and some of the pictures of the clouds look like things that we see in our house or outside. I remember, I think one was like an ice cream and the other one was like a flower. Well, now you're gonna make your own cloud. So here's what we're gonna do. The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take our blue piece of construction paper and we're gonna fold it end to end so that they touch. And then we're gonna fold it in half and then we're gonna press it down. Can you press it down? Great. If you're having a hard time, you can have your parents help you because you know what, sometimes these get a little bit tricky. Now, we wanna make sure that the two ends are touching so that the paper is evenly folded in half. That means it's folded in half into two pieces. Can you see my paper? It has one, two, two sides, and they're the same size, okay? All right, great. So now we're gonna put our paper down on the table. So now that we got our paper on the table, after we fold it in half, we're gonna take our paint and we're gonna make a design. We're gonna paint or squeeze or blot or drop or pour all kinds of paint all over our paper. Now, we don't wanna spread the paint and cover it because we're not painting today. What we're just trying to do is pour the paint all over the paper so that when we fold it in half, it's gonna get smushed and it's gonna make a picture. Are you ready? Okay, here we go. We're gonna take our paper after we finish painting on it and dropping our paint on it and we're gonna fold it in half and we're gonna smash it down. Can you see me smashing it down? Okay. That might take be a little bit tricky, but you could just smash it or pound it and make sure that all flattened out, okay? so. We're all slashed up. Then what we're gonna do, we're going to fold, unfold our paper. Are you guys ready? So we're gonna open up our ends and it should make a pretty design. Now don't worry if it doesn't look like mine because they're all gonna look different. Are you ready? One, two, three. <gasps> Ta-da! Wow, I hope yours looks as cool as mine. All right, so take a look at your drawing that you just made, your painting, and I want you to tell your mom or your dad or your aunties or your uncles or grandma and grandpa what you made, what you see. This is the cloud in the sky. Mine, I don't even know. Hmm. I think it looks kind of like a mask. So can you guys see that? The two eyes and then the mouth. Hmm. Can you see Miss Delaney in this mask? That's super silly, right? Well, you're gonna take that black marker and you're gonna have your parents or your caregiver write down what you see in the painting you made. So I'm gonna write, it looked like a mask. So here's what mine looks like, all written down. Now, you can do this over and over again with blue construction paper and make a whole bunch of clouds and designs. So, I want you to see that I got really creative and I made a cloud that looked like a butterfly. Can you see my butterfly? Kind of looks like a mask too, doesn't it? Hmm, okay. And then I made this one and it, I think it looks like a flower. Can you see the flower right here? Or it can also look like a bug. See the bug, the bug with the wings, but everybody's gonna look different and I hope yours comes out super cool and you get to put it up in the refrigerator and make 
your mommies and daddies so proud about things about nature. Anyways, I just wanted to say goodbye and I'll miss you and see you next time. Bye-bye.